Welcome to our channel. Today, we are diving into incredible benefits for international students applying to this USA University with optional English language test and a fully funded scholarship. Welcome to Debbie Radiance Immigration. Remember to subscribe to my channel. This shows that you support my work. Don't forget to like and click on the bell notification to be notified every time I post a new video. This is the University of Miami. You can go through this website and get to see the information that is about this university. So for the undergraduate program, we have the University of Miami offers more than 100 majors and programs for our students. So we have School of Architecture. So it gives us information about portfolio required if no SAT or SAT scores submitted. We have College of Arts and Sciences where we have Africana Studies, Anthropology, Art, Art History, Biology, Chemistry, Computer Sciences, Criminology, and many, many more. We also have Miami Herbert Business School, which is which has accounting, accounting and finance, business technology, entrepreneurship, general business, global business management, marketing, and many more. We have School of Communication, which has advertising, broadcast journalism, electronic media, immersive media, motion pictures. We have School of Education and Human Development. We have Community and Applied Psychological Studies, Data Analytics and Intelligence for Social Impact, and many, many more. We have College of Engineering. We have Architectural Engineering, Aerospace Engineering, Biomedical Engineering, and many, many more. We also have dual programs where you can do two programs at the same time. We have various programs you can check through. We also have School of Nursing and Health and Health Studies. We have various courses in nursing. We also has we also have School of Music and Rosentiel School of Marine Atmospheric and Earth Sciences. We have Geological Sciences, Marine Science, which is in biology, and many, many more. So we have various schools and colleges for the undergraduate uh, studies and also the graduate studies. You can go through this page and this university and get to see which course you would like to apply to. For the graduate programs, it, it has given us an alphabetical listing, which is very good. It has very many graduate programs. We have programs in accounting, anthropology, family, nurse practitioner, natural hazards, genomic, genomic medicine. We have ocean engineering, health sector management, biochemistry. We have very many courses for the graduate students. We also have language courses. We also have climate and health. That is a master of science. We have very many courses. For you, I cannot name them in one video, but you can go ahead and check them in the school website, which is University of Miami. Okay. For the PhD, which is postdoc classifications. So there are two classifications of postdoc at the University of Miami. These categories are based upon their corresponding supporting funding source, which governs benef benefits and manners of tax payment. Postdoctoral appointments are distinct from those of students, staff, or faculty in their scope, time limits, and nature of appointment. So you can check on the postdoctoral associates. Okay, you can click here. The link is here. Click here to review the University of Miami employee benefits, which apply to postdoctoral associates. We also have postdoctoral scholars. So the international credentials and applicants. It tells us that to be able to apply you have to you have to have undergone or attended a university which is accredited and also you have to go through the west program for the international credentials and applicants it tells us that domestic or international applicants that have academic credentials from or attended an international institution must have their educational credentials and outside the usa verified by an approved international credit crediting evaluation service okay for the english proficiency requirement we have academic success at the university of miami depends on the ability to communicate in english effectively so to prove 
your English language proficiency, applicants whose native language is not English must take either the English test as a foreign language, that is the TOEFL, or the IELTS. Okay? So for the on campus international students, for the admission requirements, international applicants, you can go through this page and get to see what are the requirements. We have talked about the English proficiency test. So you there is a link whereby you can apply for the graduate program. There are also transcripts. They're telling us that transcripts must, must be submitted directly to the program you have applied to. So please reach out to the admissions representative for the program for additional details. So you can get the admission representatives from the from the options that you have been given, which you can click on apply and then you get the admission representatives numbers or their email addresses. Okay. You have also talked about the exam score reports. And there are now program specific application procedures. You can get to see what your program requires of you when you are applying. Okay. So for the cost, fellowship and other fundings that is now for the scholarships, for the graduate students. So graduate students at University of Miami are encouraged to explore all the financial resources available to them. We advise students to begin and not limit themselves through the search with the following resources. resources okay. So you can finance your education as a graduate, that is the master's and the PhD, through fellowship, graduate school fellowship and scholarships. We have external fellowships and scholarships. We have loans. We have, we have cash advance and we also have graduate activity fee allocation committee. Now, when you go to the scholarships for the graduate students, we have various types. We have the Dean's Fellowship, the Dean Fellow Travel Support, and many, many more. You can check through the graduate school and get to see the different types of ways that you can support yourself by ha having your tuition covered by the university. Okay. So for the undergraduate programs, we have all incoming fall first year students are automatically considered for the merit based scholarships. So ensure that you apply to this school because once you apply your admissions, you will be considered for the merit based scholarships. There are also other types of scholarships. We have stamp scholarships and various types of scholarships. We have also, uh, they have given us the award. Like for example, the award for the stamps, we have full cost of attendance plus enrichment fund stipend. So ensure that you apply. Ensure that you apply to this university whereby it gives you the advantage whereby you can study for free. Okay. So those are the types of scholarships you can get to go deeper in your search by going to this school and going to the undergraduate program for the first year merit scholarships and the different other types of scholarships. So this is it for today's video. You can get to further research through the university website and get to see what this university offers. Ensure that you do not ignore this university. Ensure that you apply. There are various types of scholarship and they are also fully funded scholarship for international students. So this is it for today's video. We shall see each other on the next video.